welcome back to my channel it's Ashley Sharice here and in today's video I'm really excited for this video actually because today's video is going to be a luxury wish list video and I'm basically going to be showing you guys all of the luxury things that I have on my wish list and you guys are probably like luxury things like yes you guys I'm saying luxury things because if you didn't know I get my luxury stuff off of DHgate and I'm not ashamed because in all honesty, why am I going to pay designers thousands of dollars like for me buying a bag from them, I get absolutely nothing. So therefore, I will definitely get my bags off of DHgate. Um, please like, share, and subscribe and let's get straight into this video. So what I'm going to show first, I do not know the actual names. So, so I'm going to have the names of the bags like on the screen over here because I do not know the real names of the bags. So I'm going to have the real names on, of the bags on the screen. So first we're going to start off with the like classic Chanel bag. And you guys will obviously have a picture of it right on the screen. But this classic Chanel bag is literally so cute. And on DHgate they have it in tan, black, and blue, and red, and white. But I'm going to get the black one. And then like also on DHgate you can see like people show their reviews and stuff like that. Um, these are these are people's reviews on DHgate. Um, so yeah you can see all of that on there. And yes I definitely want this bag. If you guys didn't know I love Chanel so much. Like literally oh, I love Chanel so much. So getting this bag is going to be really exciting. I was kind of iffy about it though because Chanel is the one designer brand that I would definitely get a bag from. So I'm like, I was kind of iffy like, do I really want a fake Chanel bag? Because I'm like, I love Chanel so much that I would give those designers my money because I love Chanel, the brand Chanel so much. But I think that I will get that bag. So that is my first item on my luxury wish list. And then next is the like uh it's like the flip monogram you guys are gonna see it on the screen it's like the flipped monogram uh louis vuitton bag where it's like tan on one side and then brown on the other and i think this bag is really so cute it's like i want all these bags but do i really have a place to wear all these bags to i really don't but i want them anyways so yes i really really love this bag and most of the bags that I'm showing you guys, they're all under $100. Um, and yeah, so after that bag is the Christian Dior, um, like the tote bag. And I think this bag is so cute. If you guys didn't know, I love the Christian Dior print. If you saw it in my last video, I got a Christian Dior um, phone case from Trending Hype. And yeah, you guys, I love the Christian Dior print so much like I just think the print is just so pretty so I really love this tote bag but I probably will not get this tote bag because I have nowhere to actually wear this tote bag to it would probably just sit in my room and not be worn so I'm not gonna waste my money and get the tote bag and barely wear it so yeah this is on my wish list but I probably will not get it another bag on my wish list is another Louis Vuitton bag it's like the leather Alma BB bag. You guys will see it here on the screen. Um, I love the different colors that DH Gate has it in because they have it in um, like pink, red, black, burgundy, and like a creamy brown color. And they're all so pretty. And I love how shiny the bags are. I think they're really so pretty. And in this video, I'm also going to show you guys I do have a Louis Vuitton bag from DHgate already so I'm going to show you guys that after I go through this list of my wish list so yeah. So the next item that I have is this messenger bag from Louis Vuitton. It's like the three um, the three bags together like the coin purse and then the small bag and then the bigger bag and it has like the strap and if I was if I do get this little messenger bag I want it in the green color the really dark green color and I think this bag is so so cute I love chains like gold chains on bags I think they're so cute and I think this bag is like really cute for the summertime that's mainly why I'm getting these luxury bags is for the summertime because 
where I live, we get all four seasons and it's currently winter right now and it's really not fun to wear bags in the winter time because you have a huge coat on, can't even wear the stuff nicely and like look really cute. So yeah, I cannot wait for the summertime. I'm counting down the days until it's warm again. Like it's getting warmer here, but it's still not the warmest. So counting down the days for summer. So the next bag is this uh i don't even know what this is called at all but you guys will see it on the screen this bag is so cute um i if i was to get this bag i would get it in in the pink or the brown color i think is really pretty uh, i just love louis vuitton my favorite luxury brands are louis vuitton and chanel um so yeah just awesome amazing and then the next bag would be the pochette metis bag I hope I'm saying that correctly but yeah that bag I love so much I remember like last year or whatever or like the year before I used to like this was the only Louis Vuitton bag that I really knew like that and I really really loved this bag so much like I thought this bag was literally so cute I love this bag so so much because I love like when bags have like a tan and then a really dark brown i think those two colors together are so cute that's why i really like the um flipped monogram louis vuitton tote bag because i really love like tan and brown together and then i also have the um like i don't know what kind of louis vuitton bag this is but i have this on here as well because i think this is really cute i love that it's like a mini duffel bag i think bags like that are really cute that are like mini duffel bags and then i also have the alexander mcqueen shoes on my wish list as well um i don't know for sure if i'm gonna get these shoes ever because i like them but i'm like do they really serve a purpose so yeah i don't know if i'm gonna get those alexander mcqueen shoes jordans aren't really luxury but i'm not getting jordans off of dh gate i'm getting them like real jordans off of like a real website but um because I've been trying to get these, um, well, I haven't been trying to get them. I'm going to get them. Just not, um, right, right now. Um, it's the, I'm trying to click on it so I can give you guys the exact name, even though it's going to be on the screen already. But, um, they're the Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG, um, GS Pine Green 2.0. I really think these shoes, you guys are going to see them on the screen already, but I don't know, it's just something about these shoes. Like, I'm not even a huge fan of the color green, but it's something about these Jordans that I just cannot get over. And it annoys me that I wear a size 7 because the shoes are so expensive for me. I wear a size 7 in men's shoes, and it's, it's so annoying. I wish my feet were like really really small but they're not and that's fine but let me show you guys the louis vuitton bag that i already have from dh gate so this is the louis vuitton bag that i already have from dh gate i'll give you guys a 360 of the bag so this is what it looks like it is so so pretty yes and then it has ah the straps right here and then i'll show you guys what the inside looks like it's just red in the inside. I know that the real one, I think, is brown in the inside. And then um, the one that's like um, checkered print is the one that's red in the inside. But I don't care. This is red in the inside. And it has like a pocket here. And it says Louis Vuitton on the pocket. And it also came with an authentication card. Obviously, Miss Ma'am is not authentic. But it still came with a little card. It also came with a lock, but I have the lock on a necklace because I think the necklace is so cute as a lock. Like, let me show you guys. This lock necklace, I don't wear this chain a lot. I mean, you guys probably have never really seen me wear this lock necklace, but actually, yeah, I have it. I wore it on Thanksgiving on my Instagram, but um, yeah, this is literally so cute as a necklace like you guys and it has the lv right there and then says louis vuitton on the back so so cute i literally have on a silver necklace right now but it's okay so yeah it comes with the authentication card 
and then it also comes with this like strap and I did the strap like this because for some reason it's like the way that they had the straps rolled up it like is bent like this so I just tuck it in to here and one like downside that I can say about this bag like the bag is like really really cute and stuff but the downside is that I really don't like how bright the red is it makes it look fake but I could really care less if people know it think it's real or not but um yeah that's one thing that I don't necessarily like about the bag but I would definitely recommend it and then on the bottom is the Louis Vuitton monogram as well I really think this bag is really so cute though you guys and then it also does say Louis Vuitton on like the bottom of the strap and I honestly think this bag this is definitely a win I paid, I think, almost $40 for this. I think I paid like $37 or something. But I would definitely recommend um, DH Gate, especially because I think the bag is really cute. Like, it's not low quality. It's actually good. The only downside, like I said, is like if you really care about this red being really bright. But like I said, I could personally care less. But I really love this, the bottom monogram on the bottom is like so cute to me but yeah that's this bag so that is really the end of my luxury wish list video i hope you guys enjoyed it please like share and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye